Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. It is Sunday morning and I'm having some coffee and I have a quick haul to show you. It's not a whole ton of stuff, but it is a lot of fun stuff. Just got out of the shower and I'm headed off to do some errands, but I wanted to share this before I left. So first and foremost, this is colleague appreciation week at my bank that I work for. And so I'm going to decorate my department area a little bit just to make it fun and special. So I grabbed some of these. We have some glass windows. Oh, I love this pineapple. And these are large. Here we'll do our thumbnail first. Um, so I got the pineapple. And I'm getting ready to go into my office and hang this stuff up. A palm tree, how fun is that? I can't wait to hang that up. And a toucan. So we're gonna go with a little bit of a tropical theme. Then I have a bag of snacks. I'll just show you one of each. I put them in here so I could take them. Um, I grabbed a couple of these peanut butter filled pretzels. I just grabbed random snacks to put out and there was only a few of those. I'll see if I can find some more. These are some sesame chips, honey roasted pineapple jalapeno, or I'm sorry, habanero. So these are gonna be spicy. I grabbed a couple of those, um, some shelled pistachios, which actually I can have. A couple packages of honey roasted cashews. And then one of my teammates likes popcorn. So I got the Credor's Chicago mix. And it's the cheddar and caramel. Oh, I love this stuff. And then I got just some straight caramel corn. And there's a whole bag. Because I have, um, in the office, there's 14. And I'll leave them out all week. And I'll refill as I need to. Okay. Next up. No particular order, just bags of stuff. Um, also, I, oops, for the pool or the beach or any vacations I go to, these are fun. I was shocked to find them at the Dollar Tree. They're like a rubber ball covered in neoprene. We bought these as a family on vacations before, and they were upwards of $10. Um, it's just a, it's a sun bouncer. So you can throw them in the pool. You can bounce them off the deck. They're not going to hurt anything or anybody. And then they also had them in like this shape where you could skip them across the water. And I thought these were super fun to have uh, with my family. We love to play catch and sports and things while we're standing around talking. So I grabbed these just to have on hand for the pool. If you see them, I would grab them, especially if you have any youngsters that enjoy like playing catch. Because they also float, if I didn't mention that. Uh, this is new to me this year. These are treat boxes that you put together. So you, you can see the folds on them and you fold them up and they will hold candies. I got these to decorate with I'll show you some other things I got um, to put on a shelf at our office for the summertime. But these are, and you get four. So I don't know, maybe are these all silver? Oh. Okay, I think these are all silver. So I need to go back and get the red and the blue. This whole pack is silver. I thought you got like different colors and sizes. That is a no, these are all silver. Think about Christmas as well. How fun would those be to give out Christmas treats? Since you're getting all the different colors, you could just get red and silver or just silver red or even blue for like Hanukkah. I don't know if you do stars for Hanukkah, I'm not Jewish, so I don't know. But anyway, I need to find these again and get the different colors. So that was a good discovery on my part right now. Um, I got this to try. I hear folks talking about the Ioni brand all the time. And I, you know, I use mascara pretty much every single day. I don't wear a lot of makeup, but I do like a mascara, especially if I'm wearing a tinted sunblock that kind of washes me out. 
So, and it was time for me to change my mascara. I like the container. Oh, nice. It has, I mean, doesn't smell weird. I'm assuming it's fine. I usually only use these for a couple months. I know six months, I think, is what you're supposed to, but they end up getting dry and goopy, and I don't like goopy eyelashes, so if I can get it for $1.25 and I like it, I'll try it and see how it works. All right. Oh, this one's fun. So I've been um, shopping around at different stores. I love this scent. This is Peppermint Sage. I got it in the um, dishwashing soap, which is good. And I also got the spray cleaner, but these are just some wipes. I love having wipes on hand just for quick cleanups in my kitchen. And you get 30 in here. And it's plant sourced fibers and plant derived ingredients. So it is plant-based, which is nice. Um, I'm dying. Do you remember the last couple hauls ago, I got these and they were the Cincinnati Bengals containers. They have them in the Ohio State Buckeyes. I should have grabbed a ton because at Christmas time, I could give little gifts in these of candies. But I got four, so that means I'll have eight of these. And they, they're a two pack and they're great. So I grabbed those and then for my trip, somebody had mentioned that Timu has these and I do have some from Timu, but I wanted to share these with my family. So what these are, here's the package. These are travel facial cloths. And I'm gonna open this and show you because I'll be opening them anyway. So I'm not gonna give everybody their own package of this. But what it is, it's a disc. And this is much larger, I think, than the ones, oh, I got something in my eye, than the ones I got from Timu. You wet it and it opens up into a cloth to wipe your face, clean your body, or whatever. And these are dehydrated little biscuits looking things and they're great for travel i mean these are for facial and wash and stuff but if you're traveling and you have to have a quick cleanup a bathroom situation anything like that having something handy that doesn't take up a lot of space you just run it under some water pour your bottled water over it dump it in a puddle who cares just get it wet and now you can absorb it'll um get moist but it also opens up so these are fantastic for all sorts of things. And this is a five pack. So I got 10 and that will stay with my cruising stuff or vacation stuff. All right, just a couple more things. This is definitely a smaller haul. I picked up, well, I went look, this thing is sticky. I went looking for one more cork board. I've decided I want to do a four pack. And I could, I have three in cork and I had one in this light color. So I was like, well, let me just get a cork. But then they didn't have cork, but they did have this light gray that I had gotten. So I will use this one. So I got one more so I could do a four patch to hang on my wall in my craft room. And I love these. These are good quality and they're nice and thick. So you can stick your pins in them. So I got one more of those. That'll be enough. Oh, I'm obsessed. I love birds. These are individual iron-ons. Like what? You, they're iron-on transfers. And you cut out what you want. And I loved these. They, I think they're on like a fabric. So they're not even like, yeah. They're printed on fabric. And I, you cut them out and you iron them on. I love them. I think they're fantastic. So I can't wait. And I do have a press. And it tells you on the back, preheat the iron to 120 Celsius. We'll figure out what that is Fahrenheit. That's interesting that this is in Celsius. I mean, no other reason that... Hmm. I don't know. I mean, it's imported, obviously, but just interesting that it's there's no Fahrenheit directions on here, which is fine. But I love them, and I 
Cannot wait to incorporate these into some craft. Then, oh, here's the other things I picked up. These, I'm not taking them out because of glitter, but they make a little stand-up star like this. So you take your two pieces and you sit them together and they'll sit like a jack on a shelf. And these are gonna just sit on top of a filing cabinet, not shelf in my office. And I got them in silver, red, and blue. Again, Christmas time, guys. These will be so fun to just sit around if you have a big expanse that you need to decorate or something, you know, outdoors maybe even for an evening. But for the 4th of July, um, mostly it's going to be for summer for my office just because. And then I picked up these. Now, these are the little possibles for children. They're little plates. You get a three-pack or four-pack. I use them as saucers under my plants that have, you know, the holes in the bottom to drain. And I have some in like a dark blue. The issue, it's a non-issue, but I have changed all of my pots for my plants, except for one, I think, to black, white, or gray, just because. And so the blue doesn't really coordinate very well. So I grabbed... I mean, they're, these are great. If you're picnicking, lunching, like I would eat off of this plate. This is a size I would use. Um, these are fantastic for outdoor use. Camping. And I like the high sides because especially with little ones, but even if like pancakes or whatever, it keeps it from the syrup from running. I haven't had coffee yet today, guys. So four pack. I'm just going to switch out the blue ones. I'm pointing because that's where my plants are. I'm going to switch them out for the gray for no other reason than aesthetics. Um, I just bought this because it's freaking adorable. It is a little donut and it has a bunch of tiny little hair elastics. And quite frankly, if I'm tying my hair up like to ride my bike or something, this is the size I use. So I'm not even mad about that, but it is a plastic donut full of hair ties. And it was literally the last one. Oh, okay. Well, it doesn't, I don't understand why we make our, I was going to open it for you, but it's a disaster. It's got, I can't get the plastic. It's very sticky. Okay. Well, let's see if I open it, what happens. I don't even know how to open it. Tape shut too. Oh, geez. They do not want this thing to open. Because it is taped. Okay. There we go. Oh, yeah. As soon as you open it, you're going to lose all your rubber bands. So let's not open it. Cute. Right? Right. Okay. The last thing I got, for no other reason that they're Monstera leaves. I love it. What am I using it for? Not a clue. Did I have to have it? Yes. So another one of these items with this new stickering system that they seem to be using. Although I feel, oh, because it's a seasonal too. It has the green dot, which I think means they're spring. I'll show you. I'm gonna get it off. Okay. Um, you know, typical Dollar Tree basket, but it's a Monstera. This will be super fun for Mother's Day if you were giving like plants or outdoor stuff. It'd be a fun gift basket. So these are the new, newish tags that I'm seeing. And it has that green dot. I think that just means it's their summer collection. So that is everything that I got at the Dollar Tree this time around. I hope you enjoy and I will talk with you later. Bye.